Let's go live to Dr. L.C. Green of the Uchi Chapel AME Church located in Seal, Alabama. Thank you. Thank you again, Dr. Woodley. Thank God that we here another day, the first Sunday of this month in October. We are here and we are rejoicing and we are thanking God for all that he has done for us. We are thanking God for all that he has done. Thanking God for all that he has done for us this morning. Uh, glad to be on the air this morning. I'm glad to be on the air this morning. And we thank God for allowing us to be here one more time. Let us pray. Father God, we thank you this morning for allowing us to be here. We thank you this morning for all of the blessing that you have already bestowed on us. We ask that you would just continue to bless us and allow us to be a blessing to somebody else. Remind us that we are our brother's keeper and that we are to love our neighbor as ourselves. as the opportunity to present itself. I ask that you would use us in any way that you see fit in Jesus name. Amen. Amen. I want to I want to say first of all I want to say good morning to just a person long time listener. I want to say good morning to her. She reminded me last week brother brother Woodley that I hadn't said nothing to her in a while. <laughs> and she's been listening to the program ever since we've been on. So I want to say good morning to you, Sister Person. I want to ask the listeners this morning that you would please get you a, a pencil. There's an address I want you to write down because I'm going to ask you to do something this morning. Uh, I'm going to ask you to do something this morning. Uh, so I want you to get a pencil and I want you to write some information down. I'm, I'm going to try to see if I engineer can put this on the screen that so as you watch that you'll be able to see it uh, on the screen. I'm going to see if we can if we can do that. I think we can. Uh, I didn't told him about it yet, <laughs> but uh, I, I believe that he he'll, he'll be able to do that. But uh, you know the Bible teaches us that we are our that we are our brother's keeper. Our, our, uh, and the Bible teaches us that we ought to love our neighbor. The Bible teaches us that, and uh, I'm reminded of that this morning. And I'm also reminded about the question that was asked by the disciples, who are your neighbors? We tend to think that our neighbors are the ones who live in the same community with us, who live on our left or our right, <coughs> or live across the street. Mm -hmm. But if you study the Bible, you'll find out that our neighbor is anybody that we know about. Right. You know, with this modern day and age, Dr. Whitley, with all this new technology, radio and TV, our neighbors are across the across the across across town. Mm -hmm. Our neighbors are in other states and even other countries. Right. Because the media, uh, social media, has connected us with, with with so many different people. And they they have become our neighbors. The Bible also tells us that the strong must carry the infirmities of the weak. Amen. So I'm saying all that, my brothers and sisters, because I'm going to ask that you would do something. Uh, you know, I've been, I've been talking about Brother Jay up in Mobile, the young man I've been talking about for several months now. Mm -hmm. I've been asking us to pray for him. But now it's time for us to continue to pray, but we need to put some actions to our, to our prayers. We need to put some action to our prayers. Being hospitalized as long as he's been hospitalized is very, very expensive. Mm -hmm. It's very, very expensive, and and the family needs some help. Amen. And we ought to help them. We yes. ought to help them. We ought to help them. Now, now listen to me before you before you walk away, before you turn off the radio or watching us on YouTube. Or, or I'm gonna, I'm going to show you how to be blessed. Because we ought to be a blessing for others. Amen. Uh, our light should shine. I'm going to preach this day uh, when I get to the church about our light shining. Uh, we ought to shine our light where others might see, where God might be glorified. And one way that we can shine our light is by going and help others. That's right. Now, That's right. in Mobile Saturday, in Mobile Saturday, the church is having a, 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 a sale. They're selling plates. They're selling plates in Mobile Saturday at St. Stephen's AME Church. Uh, let, me, let me tell you this, and I'm going to tell you again, that the name of the church is St. Stephen's AME Church. The address is 2707 Josephine Street. 2707 Josephine Street, Mobile, Alabama, 
36607. I'm, I'm telling you that address because I want all of us to send eight dollars, eight dollars, less than ten dollars, less than ten dollars, mm -hmm. less than ten dollars. I want all of the listeners to send, make the check payable to St. Stephen's AME Church. And in your memo section, in your memo section, I want you to put Brother J, J A Y, just put Brother J. And then they'll know what it's for. Now you say that now, now I know I know I know good and well that you're not gonna fuss because you can't go get a plate. Mm -hmm. Now if you wanna go if you wanna drive the mobile and get a plate, you go right ahead. <laughs> but what I'm asking you to do is to donate the price of a plate. Mm -hmm. The plates are eight dollars. Me and Dr. Woodley gonna do it, or mm -hmm. uh, uh, Central Funeral Home is gonna do it, or mm -hmm. uh, uh, you follow TV is gonna do it, and the church is gonna do it. You can do it, my brothers and sisters. You can do it. Brother Woodley will have this address. I'm gonna give Brother Woodley this address. If any of y'all wanna get in touch with him and give him the eight dollars, we'll mail it for you. Mm -hmm. We'll mail it for you. Now, we, I need you to do this tomorrow. I need you to do this tomorrow. I need you to do this tomorrow. I need you to do it tomorrow because we want it there by Saturday. We want it there by Saturday. Those of you who are in the Mobile area, I want you to go by the church and say that you heard it on the radio and you want to make a donation of $8. And if you want to get a good plate, you can. But the main thing is that we want to be our brother's keeper. Yes. We, we, we're just keeping with the Bible. I'm just giving you an opportunity to do what the Bible say do. And all, all, all my preacher friends in this area that's listening to this program, all of you that's listening to this program, uh, I want you to do that. I want you to make a, a donation of $8. $8. Mm -hmm. $8. Dr. Whitley. Price of a cheeseburger. Eight dollars. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Eight dollars. Cigarettes cost more than that. That's right. <laughs> Just make a little sacrifice. And 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 if you don't if you don't if you don't want to mail it yourself, I'm going to be in conference all next week. I'm going to be in Phoenix City all next week. But Dr. Whitley mm -hmm. will be glad, will be glad to collect everything mm -hmm. and we'll mail it to we'll mail it for you. We'll mail it for you. We'll mail it for you. And, we'll, and everything we send, we're going to give you credit for it. We're going we're gonna to give you credit for it. We're, we're not trying to take credit for anything ourselves, but we're trying to help a family. We're trying to help a family. And I've heard all of the arguments, why are you talking about somebody that's in Mobile? Well, because we know about it. Mm -hmm. That's why we're talking about it, because we know about it. Right. Amen? Amen? Because we know about it, and we are not small enough. We, we, we're not, we serve a big God, that's right. and we are not so small that we just we just help those we who we see. Mm -hmm. We're responsible for everything that we know. I tell people, I tell nosy folks, you got to be careful being nosy, <laughs> because the more you know, the more you're going to be held accountable for. That's it. right. Ain't that right, right. Doctor Whitley? That's right. The more right. you know, you're going to be held accountable. When you know the sick, when you mm -hmm. know the poor, amen? amen. So what I'm asking you to do, uh, my brothers and sisters, is have a little compassion. Eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Let, let, let's send, let's send that. And I'm, I'm going to give this address. I'm going to keep giving the address. That's all I'm talking about this morning. That's all I'm talking about this morning. I keep telling you to go to church. And, and this is what the church is all about. That's right. And those of you who say you can, you can get it at home, you ain't got to go to church. Well, this, this is for you too. But this is what it's all about. It's all about helping somebody. It's all about caring. The, those of us who are strong, the Bible declare that we got to carry the infirmities of the yes, weak. Yes, yes. Your, your son is not in the hospital. Your brother is not in the hospital. Let's help those. And, 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 and if you do have a loved one in the hospital, if you do have a loved one that's sick, then you, you understand. You understand what it is. You understand how high medical cost is. Mm -hmm. You understand how it is trying to struggle and take care of your son who, had, who needs 24 hours care. Mm -hmm. The young man needs 24 hour care. And his mother is trying to work. His mother is working every day. Mm -hmm. we, we, I'm not talking about somebody who's just sitting around waiting for us to give them something. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? And, and, and I'll and I tell you something else, Dr. Willie. This family helps any and everybody. Mm. She, she's a radio, she, she manages the radio station. And that radio station is very, very generous to the community. Mm -hmm. 
She is very generous. That lady will help anybody and everybody she can. She puts on benefits all the time to help others. Mm -hmm. And I think that is our time to show Sister Albritton that we love her. And, 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 I'm, and I'm saying to you, uh, all of you who are listening, all of the pastors, I got some pastor friends listening. I know, I know, I know Pastor Beasley and his members, they're listening. Mm -hmm. Charles Davis and uh, Eric Griffin has begun to listen. Mm -hmm. and you, you, you know, and, and, and I'm asking y'all, I'm asking y'all, I'm asking y'all, all, all, all my friends over, over, over in Georgia, over in Georgia. Pastor Willis. Uh, Pastor Willis, yeah, Pastor Willis is listening, he's listening, he's a faithful listener, just like just a person, he's a faithful listener, and, and I know that Pastor Willis is going to respond, uh, I know he's going to respond, and all of us can respond. Those of you who borrow money, go borrow money from somebody. Go borrow eight dollars. Go borrow eight dollars and give it to Dr. Woodley. And you ain't got to buy no envelope or no stamp. We'll take care of that. You don't have to buy a money order. We'll take it. We'll, we'll do that. But my brothers and sisters, I need you to respond. I need you to, to respond to this. I need you. I, I, I would like to. I would like to. When Saturday comes, when Saturday comes, and they counting their money. Be, I like for them to have it from from just from our listeners. Wouldn't it be nice if we sent them about five hundred dollars? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't that be nice? Oh, that can, before we, we can do better we can, than that. We can do better than that, yes, Doctor Whitley. Yes. All right, all right, Doctor Whitley. So we can do better than that. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to come from the listeners. I want I want you I want you to make a make make a donation of eight dollars. Uh, or in, in in your memo, put Brother J in your memo. Make the check paper to the church. Make the check paper to the church and put in your memo or, or put Brother J and underneath that put radio listener. Mm -hmm. Then you'll know that, 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 that you're listening to this program. You're watching us all over the world, all over the world. Marvin, I want you to go through Mouse Bluff and Lake Charles area and I want you to get the eight dollars. I know they listen. I know they listening to me. Gwen up in California. Yeah, y'all, y'all get eight dollars and send eight dollars. Y'all, y'all, y'all do that. Y'all do that. Y'all do that. Little Marvin up in Oregon, get get eight dollars. Y'all, y'all, y'all send eight dollars. Wink. Yeah, y'all send eight dollars. Go. To, Wink, Wink is over at the car dealership. Go through there and 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 ask those people for for eight dollars. Wink. And let's put it in the mail and let's help this young man. Let's help this family. Let. She's she's a she's a God fearing lady, lady of great faith. And let's show her what other believers can do when we know about you, when we know about you. Amen. Some of the brothers, some of the brothers, you know what, what we, we pulling on your cable toe now. We pulling on it, brothers. Come on. Eight dollars, eight dollars, eight dollars, eight dollars, eight dollars. I, I, I know Apostle Godfrey going to respond. I know he's going to respond. Uh, I, I know it. I, I know it. I know the kind of person he is. I know the kind of person that Doctor Ware. Doctor Ware. Yes, Doctor Ware. I, 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 all I'm asking for is for eight dollars. Eight dollars can make a great big difference uh, to this family. To this family, uh, uh, it, it'll show love. It'll show love. And 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 the Bible says that that people will know that we are God's children by the way we love each other. Mm -hmm. If there's no love one for another then we ought to stop calling ourselves Christians. That's right. We all not see. We all are not see. I know Reverend Butler, I know Reverend Butler is going to respond. I, I know he's going to respond, him and his fine members over at uh, 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 Mount Level. I, I, man, we, they had, we had a great time. Last Sunday, Mount Level came over to Uchi Chapel, and we had a great time. And, and I know that I know that they're going because that's the kind of person he is, and that's the kind of person, that's the kind of members they have over at Mount Level. So we, we, we're looking that to y'all to respond, please. And let's help this family. Let's help this family. I had a goal. I had a goal of our listeners sending in at least five hundred. But Dr. Woodley has just told me we can do better than that. Right. He, we he, can double that. All right, all right. And Dr. Woodley has a greater goal. A man of great faith, and I. Mm -hmm. I thank God for your faith, Dr. Whitley, and, and I just believe that the listeners are going to respond. I, I just believe we're going to respond in great numbers. I'm going to send more than $8, mm -hmm. but all I'm asking you for is $8. I'm not trying to strain or but that's what they're selling their plates for, uh -huh. for $8. And those of you who are in the Mobile area, if you had, ever had any cooking from over the St. Stephen's, you know how good it is. But I'm going to give you that address one more time, and I'm going to... 
or, or I'm gonna try to put it on on on, on a, how you call that little thing, that little crawl at the bottom of the screen. Uh -huh. I'm gonna put it on there. Uh, Mr. Mr. Ron is the engineer, and, and he get when he get ready to, yeah, when right. he get ready when he get ready to uh, to uh, I want to show y'all something. I want to show y'all something. So you, we're not just talking, Dr. Willie, it's a twenty dollar bill. Dr. Willie just gave me a twenty dollar bill. We're not just talking. We'll put some action behind our words. He gave a twenty dollar bill. I'm gonna double that myself personally, Dr. Woodley. Uh not 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 to, to uh, uh I, I wanna let you know that the, I used I, I used to pastor at St. Stephen's in Mobile. Mm -hmm. And those people are my friends. Mm -hmm. They are my friends, they are some of the best people I've ever met. And they are my friends. That's one reason why I'm on the air. That's what that's one reason that's all I'm gonna talk about today. It's helping this young man. It's mm -hmm. helping this young man. Uh because I know, I know the members of that. They would help any and everybody. They would go out of their way to help people. I know that. I know that. Mm -hmm. And plus, anytime I need a meal and I'm going that way, <laughs> all I got to do is call. Amen. And I'm talking about I get a meal, a cake, and everything else. You understand? Mm -hmm. and that, that's the type of folks they are. And, and we ought to help folks like that. We ought to help folks that help other folks. We ought to help folks that show the, the love of Christ. That's right. And, and don't make the video a stranger. I went there, I went there, I went there, Dr. Willie. The people didn't know me from Adam. Mm -hmm. But they, 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 they stretched out their arms to me and my family. But Doc, I was, when my brother died, my brother died, my brother died, my oldest brother died in Lake Charles. And I was passing in the mobile. Mm -hmm. And when I went home on the day of the funeral, and I'll never forget this, i never forget this to the day I die. I'll never forget this. We had, I had members, I had Brother Jones and some other members come from Mobile to mm -hmm. my brother's funeral. And they, and they, and they brought things with them. They didn't come empty handed. Mm -hmm. They, they brought, they, the, the church, the church sent envelopes to me. Wow. To let me know that they loved me and my family. Mm -hmm. And that, that was, that was one of the most hurting times in my life. My oldest brother had died unexpectedly and I was hurting something terrible. They came, they came, Dr. Woodley. Mm -hmm. they, they came, they, 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 they came, and, and I, I, I thank God that I have an opportunity now to respond back to them. Right. To right. show them Amen. that uh, 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 God has opened this door for me, that I got this medium, I got this mic in front of me, I got this camera sitting here, and I can speak around the world, around the world, as folks listening to us in every state. Over in Georgia, Barbara Ann, I want you, I want you to... Uh, uh, talk to the people at the school where you work. Call Stephanie and tell Stephanie uh, uh, to talk to the people. Where, and let, let's do this quickly. Let's let's do it quickly. Let's don't drag. Let's get it. Let's get it out to the to the family, to the church. So when Saturday come, uh, we'll be already done responding. When Saturday come, those of you who are in this area, please see Doctor Whitley. I'm, I'm going to I'm going to I got to go to conf. I'm gonna be in conference from Tuesday until until Saturday. In, in Phoenix City, but uh, but I'm gonna take care of my business tomorrow, and I'm gonna ask that y'all would do the same. I'm asking that y'all would do the same, uh, uh, Brother Gifford over at Central Funeral Home. We've already talked, and Central Funeral Home is gonna represent. Mm -hmm. uh, you follow TV. That, that's 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 my sponsors. That's my sponsors, and they're gonna respond. They're gonna respond. You know, uh, anybody, anybody that's in the community, and I, I know, I, I know this, I, I know this, I, I know that as soon as Woody and Brother Stanford hear about this, they're gonna respond. That's the type of people they are. Yes. We got some good, we got some good folks in this area, and, and Brother Stanford support everything I do. Brother Woody, Woody do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Everything that I do, they support me. You know. So, Dr. Willis, you're going to have to go sit on the porch this week over at Central and <laughs> you and Brother Gifford and drink some coffee and eat some donuts and wave at folks, man. You got to wave at the people and smile. Somebody called me, uh, somebody called me, I think it was Marvin called me from home and asked me, had I been sitting on the porch of the funeral home this week? I said, no, nah, I've been too busy, but uh, I'm going I'm to do that, though. I, I uh, think that's catching on. I seen some uh, <laughs> other people uh, last week sitting on the funeral home. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we do that, man. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's an exciting life, ain't it? Amen. But all you got to do is sit at the porch on the funeral home and yeah. wave at folks. Yeah. But let me give you, let me give you, let me give you this address. Let me give you this address. Quite naturally, the name of the church is St. Stephen's AME Church, 2707 Josephine Street, J-O-S, 
E P H I N E, Josephine Street, Mobile, Alabama, three six six zero seven. Those of you who, who who would like to send them something, and, and listen, you say, well, I ain't got but two dollars. Send them two dollars. Mm -hmm. If you ain't got eight dollars, send them two dollars. Amen. But let's send them something. Let 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 let's send them something. Amen. Let let let's send something. And and you don't have to worry about no stamp. You don't have to worry about no money order. The Doctor Woodley is always available. And if I if I was going to be in town, I would be available myself. But Doctor Woodley is always available. Always available. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, so um, that 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 there's a lady in America's Georgia who's listening to me, in uh, uh, on YouTube. She she can't pick up this program live. But she's listening on YouTube, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna ask her. All, all my friends in, in Baker Hill area, Clayton area, all, all of you in Louisville, Columbus, Columbus, Abbeville, all, all, all this area. I, I know you hear me because because you tell me that you hear me. All of you, when you see me, you say go to church. I'm asking you to respond to my request. I don't I don't get on this radio and ask you for nothing. I don't ask you to keep me on the air. God is doing that. I don't Amen. ask you I don't ask you for anything. Matter of fact, every chance we get, we give something away. That's right. So I'm not asking you for anything, my brothers and sisters, but I'm asking you to help this family. This family has been overrun with, with hospital bills. This young man, and I told you, I've been telling you about him for several months. This young man, a young man. And I told you he got shot in the head, and I, that's all the details I know. That's all we need to know. We don't even really need to know that much, do we, Doctor Woodman? That's right. We just need to know that there's somebody in need. That's there's somebody that's in it. need, and I'm asking you. 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 I'm asking you, Marvin. I know. I know you're gonna respond. I, I got. I got some kin folks that I know gonna respond. Ronnie, Doctor Banks, mm -hmm. I, I need y'all to respond. I, I want a good response from Lake Charles. I want a good response from Lake Charles. Uh, 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 the the St. Stephen's family in Mobile is familiar with Lake Charles, and I want a great response from Lake Charles. And I'm going to count on you, Dr. Banks. I'm going to count on you, Marvin, to get that get get the word out in Lake Charles. Wink, I need your help, my brother. I need your help. I need your help, Wink. I need your help. Uh, uh, your boss got a got a dealership in Mobile. He did have one in Mobile. I'm sure. I don't know if he still has it or not. But Wink, help me, man. I know you can, and I know you will. Uh, uh, this is the closest I've ever come to begging. Uh, uh, people say I beg, but I, if, you, if you say I'm begging, that's fine. It's just the person talk, 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 talk to, talk to St. John. I know St. John will respond. Talk to them, just the person, uh, and see what we can do. Uh, eight dollars. It's eight. It's eight dollars. That's all it is. It's, it's eight. It's eight dollars. Eight dollars. Every preacher, uh, Pastor Beasley, uh, uh, I've already counted you in, my dear brother. Already, I already counted you in. Star Baptist, I already counted you in. Uh, Wash Williams, I'm, I'm already counted you in. I already counted you in. Zion Baptist, I, I already, I already counted you in. And I thank you very much. I, I, I want to I want to say thank you to Wash Williams and Zion Baptist. They responded to me and my appreciation. And I want to thank them for that. I really, really, really want to thank them. I I thank people and and the, 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 we, I, there's others, there's others, there's others, there's others. Mr. Patrick, I'm, I'm you know, and the whole office up there, Corner Lawrence. They they're gonna respond. That's the type of people they are. And it's it's a matter of eight dollars, my brothers and sisters. It's a matter. It's a matter of eight dollars. It's a matter of eight dollars. Eight, eight dollars, eight dollars, eight dollars. Eight. That you you can't. If you put eight dollars for gas in your car, you can't go across the street. <laughs> but you can send this family eight dollars. Amen. And it would help tremendously. Amen. It would it would it would help more than you and I would ever know. Eight dollars. If all of us would send eight dollars. If all of us would send eight dollars. Just think about that. That would be a lot of money. That, yes, sir. If all of us would send eight dollars, that would help. That, that would help tremendously. I'm trying. What I'm trying to do, I'm trying to put a dent in that medical cost, mm -hmm. and I'm trying to also make sure that 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 this young man get the care. He needs twenty-four hour care. He needs twenty-four hour care. 
And if you ain't got no 24-hour money, you, they don't care what you need. If you ain't got that money, mm -hmm. you're not going to get the care that you need. That's right. And I, I hate to think, I hate to think, I hate to think that this young man don't have what he need because we didn't respond. I hate to think that. Make the check payable to St. Stephen's AME Church uh, and, and put in your memo section, Brother J, J-A-Y, B-R-O-J-A-Y, and underneath there, just to let them know, just to let them know, just, just to let them know, just put radio listeners, or just put radio at the bottom of it, and they'll know what it's all about. Mm -hmm. They'll know what it's all about. They'll know that you either heard it uh, live here on the radio, or you heard it on the YouTube, and, and uh, uh, Speaker Dr. Woody, he come right now. Amen. Amen. I done spent some of your money, man. <laughs> Amen. He, he, he got his wallet. He, he got his wallet. God bless you. I, I I know I know we got folks that respond to the to the needs of others. I I know I know we do. I know we do. And uh, brother Woody just walked in. My, my my friend. He just walked in, and we had just talked to you. I told you he was going to respond, and Amen. Mr. Sanford is going to respond, and I, I told you that. I told you that eight dollars, my brothers and sisters, would go would go a long long yes, way. Cigarettes cost more than. Than eight dollars, and yeah, right. you can give this give this young man eight dollars, and you'll be surprised how much it'll help him. Let's uh, make it out to St. Stephen's AME Church, 2707 Josephine Street, Mobile, Alabama 36607. And in the memo, put Brother J, and at the bottom of that, put radio. And let's help this family. Let's help this family with these medical bills. If any of you ever had medical bills, you know what I'm talking about. And this young man, I've been asking you for three months to pray for this young man. I've been asking you for three months to pray for him. I've been asking you for three months. And this young man needs 24-hour care. He needs 24-hour care. And our $8 will go a long, long way. Those of you in the area, thank you. Thank you, my dear brother. My brothers and sisters, we're not playing. I want to show you again. Thank you, brother. I want to show you again, we're, we're not just talking, we're putting our money where our mouth is, Brother Whitty just walked in and, 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 and put a $20 bill in front of me. I thank you very much, my dear brother. Thank you. That's going to help the family. Me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so, so all of you listeners, please, let, let's respond to this. It, it, it's his time today. It may be yours tomorrow. It may be yours tomorrow. So please, my brothers and sisters, those of you who are listening, please, one more time. It's St. Stephen's AME Church. 2707 Josephine Street, Mobile, Alabama, 36607. A matter of $8. Put Brother J in your memo. And right under that, put, put radio. And uh, they'll know that where, where you got the information from. And those of you in the Mobile area, please run by St. Stephen's Saturday. Please run by St. Stephen's Saturday and pick up your plate. They're going to have fried and, and, and baked chicken. Uh, and if you, don't, if you can't get a plate, just make a little donation. Everything will help. If you can't give but a dollar, everything will help. You may not have Woody money. You may not have Whitley money. But whatever you have, it would be mighty, mighty appreciated. Father God, we thank you now. We thank you. We thank you for the opportunity to help our neighbors. We thank you for the opportunity to be our brother's keeper. We thank you for the opportunity to show this family that they are loved, not only by you, but by us. How, how will people know that we are your children because we love ye one another? Thank you. Amen. You have been listening to the Sunday morning broadcast of Pastor L.C. Green. This broadcast is heard every Sunday at 1030 a.m. on TV 99. Then again on Wednesdays at 9 p.m. And on Mondays it is available on YouTube for the next 30 days. Pastor Green reminds you to go to church at the church of your choice this Sunday.